What is up YouTube? Calvin from My 95 Muscle coming at you again today. This time with a 1977 Thunderbird. We've had this car for a little bit, but it came to my attention we did not have a video, so I figured I would go ahead and do a little walk around video on this guy. Um, no real complaints. You can see the paint looks like it's got a little texture to it, so it's just like not a $10,000 paint job but it's like a $12,000 car, so wouldn't expect that anyway, I guess. Uh, it does look like the trim is actually missing, like maybe a rubber piece that went along here. Uh, no big deal, it actually looks pretty good, except for the little holes. Um, tires are in good shape. Really, the only downfall to this car, I think for the most part, is the, uh, the paint itself, and, and really, is it something that you'd wet sand out or just live with I guess is the question so it does look like there's some runs in it as well a couple runs in the paint but interior we have door panels in really good shape brand new carpet so can't ask for a whole lot more than that uh, dash pad this is not a dash pad cover this is the dash pad itself is in really good shape I don't think there's really any cracks except for right eh, right there you can see a couple little spots i don't i don't think any other cracks are on the top of the dash interior horn works um you got some wood grain on the dash uh red vinyl looks pretty good Back seat's in really good shape too. Headliner's all intact and in good shape. Visors are there, dome light works. Let's check out this uh, trunk area. So, no trunk mat. You can see it's pretty clean car. No real rust. There's no rust down there. There's that little factory hole but no uh, rust holes or anything. So super, super solid car. Um, excuse my sniffling. Uh, allergies are kicking my butt a little bit. We do have the high lift jack in there still, spare tire, a couple of wiper blades. Um, bottom of the trunk lid looks like it's in really good shape as well. There's not like a bunch of rust along this edge or anything. So super clean car. Now we're gonna fire it up and take it for a spin. Oh, the, the coolest thing, let me go ahead and pop the hood real quick. The coolest thing about this car is that the AC is intact. I'm gonna set the phone down for one second. There we go. The AC is intact and it's got a newer AC compressor on it. So someone spent some money getting the AC stuff right. And I believe this one was a 351 Windsor. So let's go ahead and take this thing for a little spin. Of course, of course it ain't gonna close. There we go. All right. There's one little like rock chip there that's starting to bubble just a little bit. So it's not without its flaws, but like I said, it's a pretty solid car inside of the door jams look really good all right let's take this thing for a little spin fires right up didn't have to give it no gas the ac is blowing ice cold works pretty good like that your ac controls are over here and if you turn the ac off here do all of its stuff to turn the AC off all right and we're off well that Camaro don't want none you don't want none Camaro huh. oh the brakes I don't want to say they're touchy they're just 
they're just very good brakes like this thing stops on a dime for being a big old boat like this um, and it is power brakes so they're pretty easy to press so I know heading into winter time you might not be as concerned about having a car with AC however come next summer you're gonna wish you found that car that had AC so suspension no clunks it's nice and quiet do that again right up here I'll go a little faster this time no clunks yeah this car seems to drive awesome I did notice that it was idling just a little high I'm not sure if uh, that was because of the AC maybe someone tuned it up a little bit so that it idles a little higher with the AC it does feel really awesome uh, it could be that the choke is getting stuck a little bit um, it revs good so that's gonna complete our walk around on this guy uh, the car does not s smoke it doesn't uh, it's not real hard to start or nothing like that so that's gonna be it for this guy thanks for watching make sure you like comment subscribe and we're doing a special for the rest of November, if you come and buy one, you get one full price, okay? That's two for the price of two. Let's make it happen.